A local artist's work is being displayed at the McCroskey Art uh, Center in Grand Rapids. The exhibit is meant to showcase performance art in a two-dimensional medium. Here's Justin Othout with this week's In Focus. Throughout the month of December, the McRosty Art Center's Ginawin Creative Space has showcased the work of local artist Sam Sochi Samson, whose acrylic paintings depict performance art. My work is, uh, it's a reflection of like uh, performances that I've done throughout the years. And uh, my boss, uh, the director here, uh, mentions like, oh, did, would you like to do a show? Um, I was like, yeah, I'd do a show. And after three months, a full display of artwork was created, consisting of two pieces from Samson Simon College, while the remaining six paintings were created specifically for the exhibit. I was able, I was able to do like six new pieces, like maybe like one or two a week, and then um, uh, it all came together really well. And now they've kind of taken on a life of their own. They're kind of like keeping me busy, so I have to keep up with people wanting to like order prints or um, commission new pieces now. So it's, it's been pretty exciting. The works on display showcase a number of performances from a variety of different cultures, all meant to showcase movement in only two dimensions. If you look at the paintings, they all have like a sense of movement and like a lot of people like just love like the vibrant colors and like they look like they're gonna dance like right off the canvas and it was kind of an unintended uh, consequence but it, I really like that it, it communicated the, the dance and the, the energy of each of the dance styles that are, are depicted. With the display soon coming to an end, Samson described how it felt hearing positive reception to his work. It's really cool that when people come in and like they really um, like enjoy the paintings and the, the energy that they bring to a, a space. So it's it's been a journey. <laughs> Reporting in Grand Rapids for this week's In Focus, I'm Justin Othout, Lakeland News. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.